Hi, you guys. This is Jill at What Matters Most Now, and I am coming to you with a couple of different things. We're going to do our YouTube monetization. We're going to do our Health and More 24, and we are also, if we have time, going to go over some things that I have put up on Etsy. So a couple of product drops. All right, so let's get to it. So as far as numbers this week, you guys, Amy is at 585. That is fabulous. Good job, Amy. And Susan is at 719. Excellent job, Susan. And I am at 642. So that means we get a color in one of these. And you guys, I am so excited about the games that we have come up with for September for our collaboration. Amy, Susan, and I are going to do another collaboration. You guys will get more free games. And so it is a win-win. And then, um, yeah, we'll be starting that first thing in September. Um, Susan will be Mondays. Amy will be Wednesdays. And I will be Fridays. And then we're also going to do, let me see, for watch hours, I'm at 2348, which means we get a color in another one of these also, which means we get to add $10, you guys. Let me grab that. Here we go. And I am going to put that into our envelope for monetization. All right. Sorry, was that even in camera? There we go. I don't even know if that was in view. Okay, so we have done this. Oh, and we will color on our one here. Let's see. We're going to be... Okay, we'll color in another one of these sections. Going towards 700. Yay. All right, that is it for this, you guys. Let me put this here. Let's go on to our next item. First of all, you guys, I wanted to show you, I got this binder. I love it for Christmas. It's real tweed. It's imported and um, I'll have the link below. So isn't that awesome for a Christmas binder? I just got it today. I haven't put any envelopes in it. So far, it's just got the note paper that it came with, the grid paper. But yeah, I will be switching that over to envelopes and I will be using this for Christmas. So I am very excited about that. Yay. Okay. And then we are to, hmm, I'm trying to figure out what to do. Okay. So first let me show you some things that dropped on Etsy. So these are, you guys have seen these before. These are from the quote that my dad did. It's rise and shine, the sun shining and the birds are singing. And he used to tell me this every morning when he'd wake me up when I was a kid all the way till when I moved out of the house. And now I get to wake him up with the same thing. So these are available up on my Etsy. They come with a dashboard and this. So the dashboards are um, roll and save or you can put a number for each flower in each bird. This is one of the styles. We have three different styles that I posted. And I wanted to show you guys... Um, and they come in three different denominations, 50, 70, and 100. So the 50 is um, numbers 1 through 6. Um, 70 is 2 through 8. And 100 is numbers 5 and 10. For those of you in other countries where you don't use ones and other bills. And I wanted to show you the differences in the different type of materials. So there's three different materials on there. There's this one that is glossy. It's just a regular lamin lamination. And so the pros and cons of this are one, you can reuse it over and over. Um, uh, that's a pro. Con is it um, gives some glare, right, for videos. This is another one of the options. This is just photo paper. This is um, 68 pound photo paper. And so it's nice and thick. And um, a con of the the pro of this is it doesn't give as much shine. Um, con of it is it's basically a one-time use. So you could put um, 
like you couldn't write on it with Sharpie marker if you were doing the roll and save and you, and if you were scratching the scratch and saves that were done, um, on just the photo paper, you could scratch the paper and not be able to put, um, stickers back on them. And then this is the third, this option is a matte lamination. The great thing is there is no reflection. So that is the pro. Another pro is it's reusable. Con is you lose some of the color vibrancy. I don't know if you guys can see that, but you do lose some of the color vibrancy. So those are the three options on how they're available online. And the same thing goes for this other design. Same thing. There's a 50, 70, and 100. Same thing. They're available in just the photo, glossy photo paper, the regular lamination, or the matte lamination. And this is just a different design. And then we have a third design, which is this one. This is the matte, this is the matte one. Let me just do the photo paper one. Each of them have 14 scratch-offs on them. So let me get to one that has a scratch-off here. So you can see that there's quite a bit to scratch. And this one, you guys, is the third design, and it is Birds in a Field. So you can do a roll and save. This is the dashboard that comes with it. So you get the, once again, you get the dashboard and you get the Scratch Off Savings Challenge. And then you can um, do roll and saves for each flower and each bird, or you can um, number each one however you would like. You could say birds are worth one and and flowers are worth two, however you'd like to do it. So those are the things that are going to be up on Etsy. I'm going to move this out of the way a little bit. Once again, Chelsea was able to help me get my, my daughter was able to help me get my Etsy going again. So that was awesome. Etsy and their service people were not, but Chelsea was able to do it. Okay, so now I'm going to focus on my health and more in 24 Sorry about Tilk snoring in the back. He is a good part of my health. He's my buddy. So especially the older he gets, he um, he is by my side all the time. So if I am in my office, he is in one of his gargantuan beds and laying there and I'm snoring through all my videos. So as far as weight, you guys, this last week, this is how weird it can go. Um, so I went from 160.2 Next day I was 160, next day I was 162.2, so I gained two pounds, two ounces on this day. And I think it is more nerves and water retention. Um, so I don't know. And then I've stayed at 162.2, I went up to 162.6, and then now I'm down to 162.2 again. And then I think I did one for today. Yes, it is 162.2. So with the craziness with mom and dad, I haven't been measuring my weight every day, but um, I'm trying to keep track every couple days. So every day I have done the sauna. Most days I have also done the elliptical and the vibration plate. I also do Pilates on Tuesdays and Fridays. So I've done that as well. Wednesday was the day that... Um, I took mom to the skin doctor in the morning. Her and I went by ourselves and dad was here with the housekeeper who was cleaning his house, Jen. And, um, we came back and dad hadn't eaten breakfast yet. And then shortly after that, he had episodes. So we found out mom had shingles at the skin doctor, then got back and, <laughs> and, um, dad had an episode and we ended up in the hospital. Yep. So that was, that was that day. Um, as far as the rest of the stuff that's going on, you guys, this has been a really crazy week. Aaron is out. My husband is out in California because his mom also fell and broke her ankle and she's in an assisted living right now trying to recuperate. And then we also, um, the kids went back to school. Well, they went back to school today and, um, I'll enclose a picture here. They always take a picture in front of my front door first day of school every year. They're such cuties. And then also, um, the, the school was good. They switched to a new school district, you guys. So that's been a big worry for me because it's a hard age to switch school districts, all three of them. So they switched school districts. Seemed to be okay. The um, general consensus of it was Broxton thought school was okay. Um, did not like the food in the cafeteria. 
Cambry was able to make some friends, which was great because she's that's always a hard thing at that age. And so um, she did pretty well, but the lines were really long at the cafeteria, so she didn't even grab lunch. And then Hunter, his experience was he liked school, but he didn't, um, the school bus we were having with all our construction and stuff, um, it took him forever to get home. So he wasn't too thrilled about that. So that was um, the kid's first day back. And then um, today I was supposed to go into my old real estate office because they had some mail for me. And so... Um, I was going in to pick it up at noon and after I got mom and dad lunch and dad decided he wanted to go in and go to a store. So great. That's fine. So he was trying to get ready and he was trying to figure himself out. And I kid you not, you guys, at 345, he was ready to go. And the, we had started at noon. So um, that was great. We go to go out the door and then he decided he really didn't need what he needed at the store anyways. And so he decided not to go. <laughs> So, it, it, but I give that as an example of that's what everything just takes a long time to do. And so I went in town, I got the mail. It was actually great because there was a referral check sitting there for me for someone that I had referred to another agent, one of my clients. And so that was great because I am needing more money for Belize. And so, um, yeah, that was a true blessing. It wasn't a whole lot. It was just a referral, but, um, every little bit helps. And so that was one of my pieces of good news. Second piece of good news was the kids did well at school. Um, third piece of good news is my mom was actually excited about eating today. You guys, she has no sense of appetite and nothing tastes right. And so to get her to eat is, um, it's a challenge. And so, um, I mean, like I can get her to eat a banana every morning and then sometimes she'll eat the dinner I make. She'll at least try to eat a couple bites of the dinner I make. Lunch, she doesn't eat at all. So, um, yeah, so she said that she really wanted Taco Bell, so which is funny because they, they don't go out that often, and she want, she was craving some Taco Bell. So I picked it up for her, and unfortunately, it doesn't taste the same as it used to, so she was disappointed. But I was so excited that she wanted to eat. So that was another um, – good thing that happened today. Another one of those, um, positive things for my gratitude journal to write down. And, um, and Aaron got to see his mom today. So that was great, um, to visit with her. He'll be coming back to Boise on Friday. And so, um, he'll be coming down there on Friday. So that was all really good news, you guys. So that helps with the mental health part of health and more. As far as eating, um, with the craziness of this week, I have been, I've still been eating clean foods, but they have, I have not been able to stick to my non-refined. So for instance, I had like some Amy's enchiladas. Um, one night and an Amy's lasagna another night. So those are prepackaged and those are not non-refined. But um, we've just been doing what we can do with everything that is going on. So that is the health and more. And I think that's it, you guys. I think that was all the things. I was trying to cover it quickly so it wasn't a super long video. I've been enjoying catching up on your guys' videos when I get a chance you guys have great content and you guys inspire me to keep going and keep doing everything. And I know that Jamie and Jamie are in budgets had said, you know, even if she wasn't making videos, she would still be doing this budgeting. And so would I, but man, it's so much easier to stay on track when you know you have videos coming up to record. So even if, um, with the craziness of everything going here, even if I don't always get it out on the day that I would like to, maybe it's the next day. It's still keeping me on track, you guys. So thank you guys so much for that. Thank you for giving me something that's consistent where not a lot is consistent right now. As far as every day kind of looks a little different and, and, and crazy sometimes. So yeah, thank you guys so much. And thank you to all the new people have, who have joined my channel. And thank you to all the people who've been there and support me all the way through. I really, I love reading your guys' comments, you guys, down in the comment section. And 
it always makes my day. And sometimes it takes me a little longer to get back than others, but um, know that I read every single one of them and I do reply to all of them. It just might take me a little longer, but man, you guys always make my day. You're, you're hilarious, you make me laugh, and your support has been um, absolutely amazing. Also wanted to tell you one more positive thing that happened was Chelsea, my daughter from Cat's Hate My Budget, she was so sweet. She know that she knew that I was really worried about grandma and everything that she's my mom and everything that's going on with her with the shingles and the pain she's in. And so she did a Walmart delivery to our house because she's down in Boise and it was so sweet. She sent mom some cheesecake and she sent mom grapes and some Ferrero Rocher, however you want to say it, the little chocolate balls. She, um, she sent her pimple patches because she had read an article that pimple patches actually work really well for shingles. Go figure. So mom's got, um, she got the ones that I could cut to size. So mom's been using those. And then um, she also bought her because her eyes have been burning so bad because the shingles is right between her eyebrows on her forehead, on her face. And um, her eyes have been burning really bad. And so she... She um she sent her one of those little gel packs that you can put in the freezer in the microwave and put on your eyes. So thank you, Chelsea. That was super sweet for you to um do those things for your grandma. And it meant a lot to my mom, I know. So yeah, that was another piece of good news. So I hope you guys are having a great day too. Please let me know anything you're struggling with down below. If you would like to share, um, I'd love to try to support you in your struggles, but also please put what have been your wins for the day. What has been some great things that have happened? I would love to hear those as well and, um, and celebrate right along with you. Hope you guys are all well. Hope you have a great week and I will talk to you later for $2 Tuesday. See ya. Bye-bye.